Before you start working in Illustrator for every lesson, what I do is I actually have you remove the preferences. This is kind of weird. It's not something you're going to do on a daily basis when you're working in Illustrator, but for the lessons, if we turn things on and off, like I have you turn off Smart Guides, and in the next lesson I say, oh, with the Smart Guides on, it's going to do this. Well, if you don't turn them back on, they're not going to work. So what I do is I have you reset the program so that every time you start a lesson, it starts from the same uh, level, if you will. All the settings are set reset to the original factory defaults or whatever you want to call it. So the idea here is that you open Illustrator once. That creates a little text file called a preference file. And I'll show you where that lives. And you need to delete it before you restart Illustrator every time you start a lesson, okay? All right, I'm going to close Illustrator. On Mac, come up to Go in the Finder. Press the Option key, and you will see this Library folder. Click Library. Let go of the key. Now what you can do is if you come over here, you're going to see in the library folder, we got a bunch of stuff. Come to Preferences, right here, Preferences. And if you want to make a shortcut to that, you can. And you're going to see the Adobe Illustrator 25. It's Let's see what the real name is. Yeah, Adobe Illustrator 25 Settings folder. Go in there. Go into your uh, language. English US is mine. And you'll see Adobe Illustrator Prefs. This is just a little text file that you can get rid of. So what I'm going to do is this. I'm going to take this thing drag it into my trash, and let go. Bam, I know it's scary. You're like, you're deleting part of the program. No, you're not. That's a little file that Illustrator always recreates or looks at so it can look and see what you set in the program. So now what you can do is you can restart Illustrator. Give it a little bit here. Once it restarts, it's actually going to remake that file. Okay, now watch this. I've got it open here. You're going to see there's nothing there. As I'm doing things, whatever, and then I close Illustrator and go back over to that folder. There it is. It remakes it for you. Okay. What it does, is it puts all the defaults back in then, all the settings and everything like that. This is why we do this. Okay. I just wanted to tell you that. You will probably not do this in real life. You will probably not have to do this unless you have major issues with Illustrator. Illustrator crashes, something happens, whatever. Then you can try and throw away this little press file, open Illustrator, and it should reset it to the factory settings.